After a four hour boat ride from Cayman House, we're here at Mapari Wilderness Camp and it is gorgeous. We're on an exciting trip around South America, exploring remote wilderness areas, little known towns and cities, and really cool places. Our first destination is the only South American country where the first language is English, Guyana. We're all ready to go again. We're in the boat, ready to head up or down river, whichever way we're going. There's just the two of us. We've got two boats, cook, guides, everything. We're going to Mapari Wilderness Camp with Ashley Holland, owner of Guyana Truly Wild, an adventurer and a thoroughly nice chap. We're traveling further into wilderness, up through Kanuni River to remote Kanuku Mountains. We then go along lovely Mapari Creek to Mapari Wilderness Camp. And just like that, three and a half hours later, we've arrived at our new home for the next three or four nights. So camp is just being set up for us now. We have two Amerindian guides, Kevin and Ram, and a lovely cook, Doris. And we're coming up to my hammock here. They're all covered with a mosquito net. We are now walking from the hammock area to our exclusive pit toilet deep in the bush. Da, 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 da. And here it is. It's a very nice clean toilet. Matt swimming at the party with the butterflies. Diane taking her first dip in the water. Well, I'm just in the uh, in the bathtub of our new accommodation, which is the river. The waterfall is just behind us. Well, after a nice dip in the water, we're heading back to camp because it looks like it's going to rain. We're heading back, we're under cover of the trees at the moment, but uh, out there it's very wet. The, the bridge that the guys constructed so we wouldn't get muddy feet. Down comes the rain. Uh, it's passed over now and we're about to go for a drift down the river. A feast awaits us very soon.
sleep in this one. They have favorite trees that they sleep in. Yeah. And you can watch them going to sleep. They'll climb up to them, to the nearby branches. <laughs>